In this video, you will learn that how to interface water sensor with Arduino. So let's make the circuit. Pick the component from here. Pick the Arduino Uno. Double click on it. And now pick the LCD. I'm choosing the 20 cross 4 LCD. Double click on it. And now choose the LED. I'm choosing the yellow LED. Now choose the potentiometer. Double click on it. Choose the inductor. Choose this inductor. Now choose the capacitor. Double click on it. And now choose the water sensor. This is water sensor. If you don't have water sensor in your Proteus, you can download the libraries from the link provided in the description. And if you don't know how to add the water sensor library to Proteus, then you can watch my video. Link is also provided in the description. And from that video, you can learn that how to add water sensor to the Proteus. So double click on it. And now make the circuit. Pick the LCD, place it here, now Arduino and make the connection as I am doing. Now connect the LED. Connect it with pin 7 of Arduino. Now pick the water sensor. Place it here and now connect the inductor and capacitor with it. Connect the inductor with the signal pin. Now connect the capacitor, rotate it and connect it here. Make the value of inductor uh, 27 micro Henry UH and make the capacitor value 300 UF microfarad and now ground it. Ground the sensor as well. Connect it ground with the Arduino. With LCD. And LED. Also connect the power with Arduino. With LCD. And with sensor. Connect this pin with the Arduino digital analog pin in art and connect the potentiometer with the test pin of Arduino, sorry the sensor. Connect it here. Connect the ground and uh, power with the potentiometer as well. Now practically you have to place the water sensor in a water like this. Let me show, show it to you. You will have to place it in a water like this and uh, the work principle of uh, this is that uh, let me show it to you you can see here when water level increases 
so the resistive resistance of this sensor is a uh, come to a minimum and while uh, the water goes down uh, so its resistance will be maximum it so this is the working principle of uh, this sensor now let me make it make the water tank as well you have to place it uh, uh, in a water tank like this so let me zoom it to a specific area and then we will have to upload a code to it so circuit is almost ready and now let's check the code so here you can see the code comments are already written with almost every line so you can check it let me run it and uh, then copy the hex file address from here select it and then press ctrl c now paste it in the arduino and then click on ok also add the hex file to the water sensor as well uh, and that can be found in the library folder click on edit properties and then go for this it so here you can see the water sensor library for properties you can download it a link is available in the description so open it and now here select the water sensor dot hex file so click on the ok and now run the simulation So here you can see that uh, my channel name the bright light water sensor the project name and you can see the water level and here you can see the LED and it's uh, turned off now this potentiometer uh, is used as a changing the value of the uh, water level so while uh, changing the value from this to this so this means that water will uh, be filled up from bottom to top so let me increase the resistance uh, the potentiometer value here you can see the level it's a eight percent now so let me make it increase so here you can see 34 35 percent increases 51 percent now increase more 67 85 so let me increase it more here you can see when it reached to a 90 the led turned off so this me and you can see her tank is full message on the lcd as well so when the level reach to a 90 or more so it will be considered a full and while less than 90 so it will not be considered a full tank so here you can see it below now it is below the 90 percent here you can see the led is turned off also it not showing that the tank is full so let me increase it more here you can see tank is full the led is also turned on let me increase it more and here you can see 99 percent and uh, till it's saying that tank is a uh, full also the led is uh, turned off let me decrease it again here you can see tree to a zero and while changing the value of this potentiometer you can see here the level changes so this means that water is uh, filling up from bottom to top like this and when it reached to a 90 or more so it's saying that tank is full also the LED is turned off so this was the water sensor and you have learned here that how to interface it with Arduino the circuit diagram and code link is available in the description you can download from there libraries is also available in the description you can download from there if you like the project please subscribe my channel also like and share the video, visit my channel for more videos related to Arduino. Thanks for watching.